What's really interesting about intuition is that it tends to have a kind of metaphysical flair, right? People talk about being intuitive as having some kind of sixth sense that tells you what to do, some kind of ethereal orientation that leads you towards a place of illumination. Follow your gut, listen to your intuition and your instincts. But the reality is that intuition comes from a place, of the, uh, a function in the brain called what's referred to as the adaptive unconscious, which reminds me of Carl Jung's idea of the collective unconscious. But the adaptive unconscious is, is sort of a repository of experiences and memories and dreams. It seems to be kind of like the liminal zone between dreams and reality. And when people talk about intuition, it really means that they're tapping into their adaptive unconscious and they're probably browsing through a series of sense impressions and quickly making comparisons between the current situation or scenario and past experiences and so on and so forth in a kind of boundary dissolving, uh, sensory dissolving, synesthetic, unconscious dreamscape. And then the result is, my intuition tells me I should do this. But again, grounded in science, which is what makes it all the more fascinating.